Soviet Union officially collapsed in 1991, and 15 new democratic republics were formed. One of these 15 was Georgia, a Soviet state located in the Caucasus. Georgia was thrown into a period of turmoil as the nation was struggling for independence, and now with their independence period granted, there was a lot of chaos. The ethnic regions of Abkhazia and Southeast Ossetia wanted to be, be free from Georgian rule and form their own republics. Ultimately, Georgian nationalism swept the country. Zvid Gamaskoria was the very first president of Georgia, but he would be overthrown in a coup and he would set up a violent uprising to regain power. He does this, and this only gets the state government to resist Gamaskoria, beginning the civil war. On top of this, the republics of Abkhazia and Southeast Ossetia would also revolt against Gamsakordia, also starting an internal conflict. They began to rebel in central in Georgia in late December 1991. By Ger January, they had captured majority of Georgian government land and set up a puppet state, the Autonomous Republic of Adjara, a state council stronghold. The Russians rushed to support the state council, seeing Gama Sikordia as a fascist. There would be little to no fighting until March, where the state council would overthrow Gamsa Kordia. However, there was Southeast Socia and Abkhazia who had also been resisting Gamsa Kordia's government, but wanted full independence. From 1992 to 1993, the Georgians would fight the Abkhazian and Southeast Ossetian separatists. War ended on December 31st, 1993, when Gamsa Kordia was killed in action. Edouard Shermanze would become the second president of Georgia. Southeast Socia and Abkhazia would submit to Georgian control for now. The two would still rabble and fight hard for independence through the rest of the 90s until the Russo-Georgian War when Russia invaded Georgia in 2008.